यतः दैट फ्रॉम विच प्रवृत्ति भूता नाम ऑल लिविंग बीइंग्स एक्टिविटीज आर स्प्रिंगिंग फोर्थ आफ्टर ऑल ऑल दिस वर्ल्ड थिंग्स ऑफ द वर्ल्ड आर ऑल मेड अप ऑफ मैटर How is it that the beings are able to function in the world? Matter is inert and insentient. Beings are dynamic and conscious. Where do they get their dynamism and consciousness? Because of life. In it. Here, the teacher says, "Yetaha that from which." that mysterious center let us say that secret essence from which enlivened by which all living beings are interacting between themselves and the world around etat pravarte bhutanam yena sarvam idam tatam that by which all these world of beings are permeated you are also conscious he is also conscious all living beings whether it's a unicellular organism plant or animal or human all living beings are conscious this consciousness existence knowledge and bliss is constantly in everything that great reality by whose grace all activities are going on inert matter becomes magically enlivened to act and to know things <clears throat> that which is not in certain beings but in all beings equally present as the oceanic waters are in all waves sarvam idam tadam swakarmanam tamabhartya invoking him worshiping him by your own karma swagarma according to the quality of you and the, uh, yes the, the the duties that have been prescribed to you meaning your profession whatever be your profession choice of profession and your choice is according to your own vasana invoking him worshiping him adoring his altar with your work not with flowers nor by candles these are only external dramatization but when you are invoking him and with what with the fulfilled the duties fulfilled in life in short in all your activities remember him just as an ambassador will have to always remember his government and his country he has no individual personality at all he is no more the son of his father who is here the ambassador but the ambassador is the government itself ambassador of india he is india government he has no personal opinion he doesn't do anything by himself himself is a non entity but as a representative of the government he can sign off the country for billions of dollars of debt his signature not that he the individual the individual we would believe I mean, have faith in him for ten dollars. But as the ambassador of a country, he can sign off billions of dollars. That why? Because he is totally surrendered to the government. If you ask him about an opinion about a thing, the new government that has come in India, what is your opinion? <laughs> we have no instructions why i don't know i must know the mind of the country then only i can give you 
he will not give his own opinion. Right? He is totally surrendered to the government. In the same way, one who is surrendered to him, he who is everywhere present, he who is enlivening everything, he who is giving me the, the, the power to serve the society, nay, he who has given me the field to serve, nay, he who has given me the field, the equipments, and the power to use those equipments have been given. So all these are, only my attitude must be, that it is all by thy grace alone, O oh Lord, I am doing. Not I, not I, thou, thou, thou. With this idea, Abhircha, Siddhim Vindadi Manavaha, man can reach the highest Siddhi, fulfillment, highest fulfillment. By thus, you are BMI, encountering situations of OET, by contacting the world physically, mentally, intellectually, according to the station or quality of your own personality. Eh? Surrendering all activities, all, all activities oriented with the remembrance of that mighty presence. The existing person has to get exhausted, mind becomes quiet and quiet mind has got the greater contemplativeness and through that he will reach.